We're going in. Hmm. It's an old videograph. Videograph. Is that Charlie? Did she come back? Because this is her new look. That is Charlie. And those two girls? Maybe this used to be Charlie's room. But why did the little girl point to his closet? This definitely used to be April's room. What's his connection to all of this? What? Shit! What the fuck are you doing here? This is my room! Get back to... Wait. I don't know you. Who the hell are you? Um... We haven't been unreasonable lately. Don't talk to me like that. Who are you? Who am I? Who am I? I am the fucking supervisor, that's who. Now who the fuck are you? I told you, don't talk to me like that. Fuck you! Ha! Oh, fuck! Fuck! You punched me! Well, you attacked me. Jesus, I wasn't gonna do nothing. You punched me in the nose? Fucking hurts. Oh, shit, shit, my face. <laughs> yeah, well, you're lucky it's just your face. I'm black belt. So what the fuck do you want from me? Oh, fuck. Fucking hurts. I'm looking for a friend of mine. He was here last night looking for information. Maybe he talked to some people, I don't know. Point is, I need to find him. If he's been here, maybe you know where he went. I don't know. I, you'll come in here and you punch me in the face? I should fucking... Ugh. What's his name? Let's go with Jericho. Reza. Damn it. Reza Tamiz. Yeah? So what's in it for me? I don't punch you in I the won't face anymore. I punch you again. Ha! <laughs> okay, I'll pay you. 500 if you can get me any information about what's happened to him. Another 500 if you help me find him. Jeez. 1,000 watts. If you help me find him. I'm good for it. Hmm. Looks like it. So this guy must be real important to you. You're screwing him? Fuck I you. don't need another excuse to kick your ass. Jesus. All right. Can't a guy ask? No. Christ. You're touching. Okay. I could use a thousand just about now. So, so what's this guy's name again? Rez what? Reza Tamiz. He's about your height, black hair, tanned, probably well dressed. He was here last night. I'll see what. It's a thousand, right? Would you give me the 500 up front? No. You get your money when I get the information. If you don't want to do business, I'll. Fine. So, how do I contact oh, you? Oh, don't give him your cell phone. Do you know the fringe? Who doesn't? I'll be there tonight. Yeah, sure, you will. You know how difficult it is to get an invite? It's like a two-year waiting list. Just come back here later, and we'll... No, the fringe. I've got connections. I'll make sure you're on the list. No fucking way. That's awesome. If you told me that right away, sweetheart, I'd have found your friend for free. Oh, uh... Okay, so hmm. I'll see what I can dig up. The fringe? Fuck. Awesome. All right. So we got a deal. Come on. I'll let you out the front. DNA lock. Unbreakable shit. Yeah, this place is an impenetrable fortress. Ha. Huh. Alright, that went reasonably well, all things considered. We punched a guy in the face. I love doing that. That's that's false. But he was kind of being a douche. He's going to let me out of here. Alright then. I'll check around. See what I can find. Now tonight, the fringe. You're not trying to con me. Or What's the worst case scenario? I'm you show very up. Serious. Give this, this friend of give mine your name, and the guy goes, "You're not on the list." Whatever. As long as I'm on the list, and you got the cash. Uh, uh, wait. What was your name again? Give him a fake one. Zoe. Damn it. What's yours? Marcus. You don't have a last name. Neither do you. No. Do you? <laughs> You're a player, Zoe. I'll give you that. Okay, Marcus. Thanks, I'll see you later. We know this guy is like pure evil, right? He's the head of this place that has people being experimented on and turned into like weird bathroom treading zombies. Alright, whatever. 
All right. So you just gotta speak to Charlie about uh, what was in the photo. This is another way to go. And I guess to get him on the list. What we've got? We think we've got connections just because we talked to the guy once. You go there during during the daylight, and what you just get in. That's how it works. Whatever. I would not be surprised if Charlie was like, "What the fuck? No, I can't let you. What? No." See, that was the way that used to go to, to Vava. But alright. Yeah. Hi, it's Zoe Castillo again. May I come in? Of course. Charlie's a nice guy, though. He likes us. I bet we remind him of April, because we're smart and we're doing our own thing. Uh, I say as I get stuck on furniture. Charlie seems like a really nice guy. He is a really nice guy. Hey, you're back. Surprised? You look like you could take care of yourself, so no, not really. Did you find your friend Jericho? His name's Reza. I uh, know, not yet. But I have a lead. Good, yeah. I hope you find him. He seemed like a nice guy. So, um... I guess we can ask this. You haven't heard from Reza again, have you? Sorry, girl. If he calls, I'll let you know. Somehow. How long ago did you say you lived at the border house? Ten years. Why? It must have changed a lot. It was a horrible place. There was one room that looked okay, but the rest of it was just horrible. Ten years is a long time, girl. The world can change completely in a decade. Thank you, Charlie. For what? Listen, feel free to hang out here for as long as you want. Maybe your friend will stop by again. I've got a bartender now. I didn't notice her. Uh, about that, um... Could you tell me anything about this picture? That's you, isn't it? Jesus Christ, where did you find this? At the hotel. Room 201. I found it in the closet and I figured you'd <laughs> Found it in know. a closet. I mean, that is you, right? Ten years and a lifetime ago. This is not what April yeah. looked like ten years ago. I can't believe that graph would still be in April's old room graph? after all this oh, time. Oh, photograph. April. Videograph. April Ryan. The girl in the middle. 201. That was her room ten years ago. Did... Did you say April Ryan? Yeah. Why? Uh... That name sounds very familiar. Maybe now would be the you time probably to... probably got her mixed up with someone else. April vanished back in 09, just days before the collapse. We spent a long time searching for her before we... before I gave up. Mm -hmm. Emma, on the other hand, she never lost faith. She still thinks April's alive and out there somewhere. Emma's the other girl in the picture. Yeah. They were the two best friends I've ever had. But I haven't heard from Emma in years. And April... Mm -hmm. Let's just say that I don't share Emma's faith in miracles. How did April You're right, she's yeah. probably gone from this world. No, I'm not comfortable talking about this. It's private stuff. That's fair. No, let's... The, come on. I completely understand, Charlie. It must have been hard on you losing your best friend like that. I'm sort of going through the same thing myself, except... Except I still believe Reza's okay. I'm sorry, girl. I'm sure he's okay. From what I could tell, your friend's pretty smart and resourceful. Look, why are you so interested in April Ryan? This is gonna sound crazy. Can't even believe I'm telling you yeah, this, but... Yeah, let's confide in Charlie. I've heard the name April Ryan recently. I've been seeing things. On screens. Back in Casablanca, at, at the hotel. Strange, creepy things. At first, I figured it had something to do with the static. That might still be the case. But I think there's more to it than that. There's this snowy landscape, a strange black house, a girl, 
I know it sounds completely insane, but the girl, she speaks to me. Directly to me. Through the screen. Find yeah, her. Yeah, you sound her. crazy. At first that was all she said. And then, find April Ryan. Find April. Save April. When I was inside that place, the hotel, I saw the girl again. Uh, she pointed the way to April's room. You're, to you're the okay? Where you're I found look the very picture. tired. Jesus. If you're right, if this isn't some kind of sick joke, I need to contact Emma. She still believes April was telling the truth. Wait, about what? The truth? About what? Can you stick around, Zoe? I'm sure Emma will hop on the first vac tracks or scramjet out of your office. Scramjet. And she'll want to hear this from you. Once she gets here, we'll tell you the whole story. I promise. All right. Also, Charlie, I need to add someone to the guest the April list. April Ryan I've heard of might not be your April. I don't want you to get your hopes up. Oh, come on. April disappeared under some very strange circumstances, Zoe. If there's even a tiny chance that this has anything to do with her, we need to pursue it. The girl pointed okay. to her room. I have to wait here for and this a guy to contact her. me anyway. Marcus. I met him at the hotel. Marcus? This is starting to sound like a damn family reunion. Wait. Marcus was a friend of ours back in the old days. Until he got into Amethyst in a big way. I don't remember Haven't Marcus. Haven't seen him in years either. But I heard he got a job at the, uh, the hotel. Yeah. He's some kind of caretaker. And you're right. It's not a hotel. I saw something while I was there. They're testing some kind of device that hooks up to your head. I've seen it once before. It's probably what brought Reza to Newport. Marcus. Anyway. That wasn't the douchebag, was it? Marcus said he'd help me find out what happened to Reza. For a so, I'm so glad I punched him I in the face. I told him to meet me here later. I hope that's okay. No problem. This is the safest place in Newport. Nothing gets in or out without me knowing about it. I'll make sure his name's put on the guest list. I'm going to go call Emma, and then I need to take care of some business, but you can just hang out here. I'll have the kitchen make you something to eat. All right. That would be nice. I'm starving. I haven't eaten since the train. Jeez, me too. You come to the right place. Our sashimi's the best in town. Ah, sashimi. Find yourself a table, and I'll have someone take your order. So we love Thank sashimi. You. Wait, Charlie? Yeah? You really think Rez is okay? He's an investigative reporter, isn't he? Jericho's famous. Really? I'm sure he's been in worse scrapes. Don't worry, he'll be okay. Ah, I guess we skip the scene of her ordering sashimi and then eating it. Fumbling with the chopsticks a little bit. Sashimi. Fun fact, both sushi and sashimi are can contain raw fish. Sashimi is just raw fish. Sushi is, I think, what makes it sushi is the rice. So you can have sushi rolls, which are the ones with the, you know, the seaweed around them. But you can also have sushi that's just like pits of fish on rice, and that also counts as sushi. And that's everything. I know it's not much, and I know it may not even be your April Ryan. It's, it's probably your April it is. Ryan. It has to be. I don't believe in coincidences, and this would be one enormous coincidence. Well, she could be trying to get in touch with us, Charlie. Maybe she needs our help. Maybe... Don't get your hopes up, Emma. We don't know anything yet. We did finally confide in them ask, about Arcadia, didn't Charlie, we? Charlie, you promised you'd tell me what happened to April. Yeah. Yeah, I did. She disappeared under some very strange circumstances. The day she vanished, corporates were after her. I still don't know why. They stormed the house and... Emma got shot. She almost didn't Jeez. make it. As for April, she made it out. And that was the last we heard from her. But we know she got away. She was identified on security cameras uptown. And we found out later that she had boarded a shuttle to one of the orbiting stations. Oh, she went to space. That's where the cookie crumb trail ends, however. Right after that, the collapse happened and everything changed. When things returned to normal... We were too busy putting our own lives back together. And by the time we started looking for her again... April was gone. Vanished. If it hadn't been for the things she'd told us, I would have simply believed that she was another victim of the collapse. What things? What's the collapse? This is where it gets complicated. See, Zoe she knows what it is, so they don't have to explain it to me. sort of parallel magical dimension. We didn't believe... 
You didn't believe her, Charlie. I never doubted her. Fine. I didn't believe her. I'm still not sure I do, despite the things I saw during the collapse. Wait. April told you that she'd seen another dimension? Not seen. Been to. A place called Arcadia. There was this man. Cortez, a real weirdo. <laughs> he told April that she had some kind of talent, power, to travel between worlds, and that she was needed. According to what April told us, there are two worlds. This one, and the other one. Arcadia. A world of magic. They exist in parallel, in balance with each other. I never had reason to doubt anything April said before, but even I was skeptical. So after I got out of the hospital, I started digging. And the things she told us... She's not the only one, Zoe. There are others who've traveled and seen Arcadia. It's real. Look, we don't know that. All we know is that some dangerous idiot put ideas into her head, and... I know, Charlie. Have some faith, okay? I know. I can feel it. I've done a lot of research. When you have enough money, even the best-kept secrets are revealed to you. Students I'm living sorry, in boarding you know, houses are well-known for having a, a lot of money. Crazy. Delusional. You don't think I've thought the same thing myself? How old were you when the collapse happened, Zoe? Nine? Ten? Ten. And do you remember anything about it? Oh, thank goodness. Not really. We were living in London at the time, and our subsection was shut down for several days. My dad, he wanted to protect me. I didn't see much. Most people don't remember, or they pretend to have forgotten. Those of us who saw it, you don't forget something like that. Please explain. But there were things happening even before the collapse. Strange things, like, like dreams leaking through into the waking world. Looking back, everything I've seen, read, what people have told me, people who had no reason to lie to me. I know she was telling the truth, and I believe she's still there. In Arcadia. Okay. Okay, so let's say you're right. The messages I've been getting. You think that winter place is the parallel world April talked about? Arcadia? From what I know, it doesn't sound like Arcadia. But who knows? The question is, who's the little girl, and why is she trying to contact you? After all, you didn't know April Ryan. Her name meant nothing to you until today. Chance brought you here, and if you hadn't found the picture and showed it to Charlie, you would never have recognized April's name. It seems improbable, I know, but Reza is the link. The story he's working on must have something to do with all of this. It's the only explanation I can think of. Your friend, the journalist, you still don't know where he is? No, but with any luck I might find out later tonight. Actually, Charlie, is there somewhere private where I can make a call? Maybe Reza's tried to contact me. I'm going to try his mobile again and check in with my friend Olivia back in Casablanca in case she's heard from him. This is all sure. very reasonable. You can use one of the private lounges upstairs. The last one on your left is empty. Don't Thanks. sit down. I'll be right back. Seats are a little sticky. All right. So upstairs. Oh, stairs. I see. Last one on the left. Uh, all right, I'll just stand here and use my phone. I'm in a designated phone space. Hi, this is Reza. I'm either busy or I'm sleeping. Either way, let me know what's up, and I'll call you right back. Thanks. Hi, it's me again. I'm in. I met Charlie, and I followed your tracks to the hotel. I found your lighter, and there was blood everywhere i hope everything's okay reza please call me if you when you get this message i'm not about to give up on you but i need to know that you're not i need to know that you're okay talk to you soon bye mm. oh god hey you got yourself a vip booth marcus i was just about to convenient because i brought some friends along and they'd love to say hello He just bitch slapped me? Or she, I guess?
Oh god. Oh god, no! Shit. Winter. What? Where? Where am I? It doesn't feel like a dream. I should be freezing, but I don't feel cold at all. Actually, I don't feel anything. This all looks so familiar. The visions. This is the place from my visions. Nice house. Alright, I'll bite. younger version of us? I don't understand. Please. What do you want with me? Find April Ryan. Hurry, Zoe. Hurry. She doesn't have an accent, but what do You must hurry. Go. Now. I was going to say a younger version of April, but she has the long hair. Eep. Jump. I know there isn't a jump button, but you can do it. I believe in you. We're suddenly dressed for winter. Where the hell am I? Oh, geez. This is not real. This cannot be real. I need to, to... I need to wake up. Or get out of here. I need to do something. Anything. Ah. <sighs> Jeez, it... It looks like we've made it to Arcadia. Ah. Oh. This is... This is gonna be rough. 